here comes the proud African in me. I've got to tell you, by the way, I am Zulu. Uh, I said this to uh, Ilav yesterday. It's important for me to tell you that I'm Zulu because if you ask a Zulu person, who are they? They won't tell you what country they're from. They won't tell you what, uh, uh, what school they went to. They won't tell you their name. They will tell you first that they are Zulu. Why? Because we Zulus believe that there are two tribes in the world, Zulus and everybody else. We come from a great lineage of warriors. My family, for instance, Tembegwayo is a Zulu word that means the trusted ones. We come from a great lineage of warriors that were protectors and trusted. We conquered lands. We were true warriors, we were. First time the British Empire was ever defeated in the heyday of the British Empire outside Britain was when they came to face the Zulus in Guazulu. Yeah. Marvel at my glory. So I would not be a true African if I didn't tell you about the proud history and heritage of my continent. What are the, some of the things that have come from Africa? Let's just go back. Let's cast our eyes back a couple of thousand years. Did you know that the precursor to the system of mathematics in the world as we have it today was first discovered by the Ashango tribe in West Africa? I'll tell you a bit about that in a minute. Did you know the first medical procedure ever, informed, uh, uh, ever performed in the world was performed first by the Egyptians? Just over 2,700 thousand, uh, BC. Did you know? And of course you do. That some of the most phenomenal architecture still rests resident in the continent. Let me tell you a bit about the Ashango tribe, because they, for me, were fascinating. The Ashango tribe in West Africa found a specific species of baboon. And they found with a specific species of baboon that regardless of height, width, or weight, the distance between the forearm and the elbow of all baboons, male and female, was exactly the same. This was an important discovery, because what they wanted to do was to measure instruments, you see, and they figured that if they could use this specific bone as a measuring instrument, they then had the ability to measure. It was the precursor to the system of mathematics as you have it today. So in simple English, what I'm saying is every single time today you find yourself using a number, you should thank Afri. Thank us. Just us. First medical procedure performed in Egypt. Large best architecture in the world. I've had the privilege of going now three times to the pyramids in Egypt still. And they are, of course, a modern marvel of engineering and architecture that the world today is still trying to understand. Voice of Africa by Africans.